Well, finally back at the studio. So, for the past few videos, I haven't been there. I've been on vacation and if you've watched the previous videos, you know that my computer sort of died. Then I had to repair it. I made a beat. It was a huge mess overall. Today I'm back at the studio and I'd like to create something. I just need some creative outputs today. Recently I was thinking about making something with an FM synthesizer. Before I was using FM8 and that's what we are going to use today. And what I really liked about those sounds, since they are synth sounds, thanks to the specifics of the frequency modulation synthesizers, they sound much more natural and much more vivid and I just like to make something more with it. Well, this is what I was talking about. This thing could be used uh, to layer an existing 808 track and make it super aggressive. Without using any distortion, it would be much cleaner because the distortion, the, the, the aggressiveness in this case comes ex straight from the, from the synthesizer. Now let's copy this and let's paste it to another group. Let's add the 808 and let's hear how it sounds like. Nice. Okay, let's drop some drums. Here's my drum kit. One, two, three, four. What I will add right now is a distorted vocal sample that's going to give us a little bit of the texture. So as you could hear, it doesn't sound really good. That's because this sample has a full instrumental on it, including the lower frequencies, which we are going to get rid of now. Now I'm going to use Native Instruments Byte to reduce the bit depth of the whole sample. Okay, good. Now let's move back to the instruments and let's find a nice plucky kind of sound. I'll try to stick to FM8 too. Uh, so let's get into plucked strings. This one sounds really nice. It's dirty, it's really rich. Let's try it out. <laughs> 
One, two, three, four. As you could hear, I moved this pattern a little bit to the background. It added a nice kind of melodic texture uh, to it. And I think it's done. I don't like to overproduce my beats and this is it. In the upcoming videos, I finally want to use this bad boy. I've been trying to mix with it already, but I still don't feel that much comfortable when using it as I would work with uh, a digital solution on a computer. Well, this is it. Thank you guys for watching. My name is Dominic. You've been watching my channel and keep the good vibes alive.